Libras, welcome. How are my beautiful Libras doing? This is your girl here, Miss Hawaii. I love you guys. You're beautiful. You're sexy. You're abundant. God loves you. Blessings to all of you. Welcome to the Miss Hawaii show. Mm. Light up. Smoke a J. Take a shot. Whatever you like. This is the channel where you come to be yourself. We ain't got time for no fake shit. You heard? Libras, thank you for all your views on the last video. Y'all killed it. I fucks with y'all, Libras. You know I always say my, uh, my fellow moon sign. Libras. Any of my new Libras that are here watching or cross, cross watchers, welcome. I'm Miss Hawaii. I'm going to give you your general love reading, okay? This will apply for, whoop, this will apply for all my Libras who are sun um, Libra, moon Libra, rising. This one's for you, okay? Uh, if it resonates, don't forget to leave me a comment. Don't forget to like the video, okay? And subscribe. Show your girl some love. Let me know I'm not wasting my time or yours. If you would like to inquire about a personal reading, the high priestess popped out. That's your theme message. So about using your intuition, okay, with the hangman here on the bottom of the deck. Sacrifice. All right, Libras. Beautiful energy, okay? Some of my female Libras, you're, you're, you're looking like the divine feminine. You're connecting with spirit. Look at you. You're beautiful. You have a lot of people who are attracted to you who feel like you're, um, that they're beneath you because you're so powerful, Okay, you're walking in power, Libra. My male Libras, look at you. Divine masculine, look at you. Connecting intuitively, feeling, your, feeling yourself around everything, feeling your way through situations. You're brilliant. You're brilliant. All right, so if you would like to inquire about a personal reading, you can do so by emailing me at MissHawaiiReadings at gmail.com. All right, that's MissHawaiiReadings at gmail.com. I do ask for about a week to get you your reading to you because I do get quite a bit of requests, okay? But if you do have an emergency and you need the reading within 24 hours, you can request that by paying an expedited fee, and I will get you your reading delivered to you within 24 hours after payment has been received, okay? So that's MissHawaiiReadings at gmail.com. I love you guys. Thanks for all your kind emails, your kind words. Thank you for all your donations. Thank you for following my little kitty, Kayleona. I'll put all the information about following my little diabetic cat in the description box below. Also, I'm doing something new, starting with my Libras, okay? So I'm going to get into how you're feeling in this reading. Show me what's going on in your love life, okay? In the extended video, I will be discussing the person that you're thinking about. Getting into how they feel about you and what their actions will be moving forward, okay? So I'll put the link to the extended video in the description box below. Um, if you would like to donate to my channel, the information is below as well in the description box. And I thank you guys for all your donations that you've been giving me. You're wonderful. Those donations go straight to new tarot card decks, go to sage, candles, things like that to help me um, deliver the message from the universe to you guys. So I appreciate you guys. I love you. Thank you for every comment. Thank you for every view. And thank you for every like. And thank you for your positive energy. All right? This is a positive only zone. Everybody knows that. Don't come on here talking no shit. You gonna get cursed out? All right, without further ado, let's get into my Libra. Okay, Libra, I'm doing the reading a little bit different now. You're gonna see how I'm gonna do it. All right? Spirit, please, thank you for a clear and guided reading to all my beautiful, sexy, strong, smart Libras. Thank you for allowing me to be able to help them, give them guidance and love. Please show me how they've been feeling in love, spirit. Show me how my Libras have been feeling in love, spirit. How have my Libras been feeling in love? All right, Libras. Are you ready to begin? And take a sip. We already know at the heart of the reading, it's about you using your intuition. You being the high priestess. The Ten of Cups. Okay. The Tower. Oh, shit. Page of Cups in reverse. Page of Swords in reverse. Somebody spying on you guys. Or you guys might be spying on somebody. The Hierophant is here in reverse. The 
All right, let's see what's going on with my Libra. So, the Wheel of Fortune is in reverse. Let's 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 deal with the major arcana first. These are the major things that are going on right now in your love life, Libra. We got the Tower. Okay, that's the one of the most craziest cards here. Okay, Scorpio energy. So this shows me here. There's a transition. Some type something happened here. Some type of shakeup happened here, Libra. I don't know if it was a breakup. Okay, but something happened that was unexpected and threw you off with this with this tower. This is a breakthrough here. This is a foundational shift in view. Something here came down. Something here was either revealed to you or something chaotic happened, okay? The other major arcana is the Hierophant in reverse. So this shows me that maybe there was some type of separation, Libra. Breakup, divorce, broken commitment with this Hierophant in reverse. This is Taurus energy. So some of you can be dealing with the Taurus. Something here that ended possibly, some type of broken commitment. Something here that you really believed in and you really thought was going to be it under the Ten of Cups. The Ten of Cups is our happily ever after card. Okay. Family, children possibly involved here. Okay. But this is you knowing what you want in love. Okay. Now the next major arcana card I'm seeing is the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. My favorite card in the entire deck, but in reverse. Which shows me Libra, right now you feel like things are not moving the way you want them to move. Things are not going as smoothly as you would like okay but you need to remember the wheel turns it keeps turning so things are going to change you know what i mean sometimes we feel like oh my god this is the end you know sometimes things have to go bad for us to appreciate the good time so right now i can tell this is a turbulent time for you especially with this tower card okay those are your three major arcana cards that i'm seeing all right very very heavy energy now, I'm seeing you as an emphasis here on you wanting your happily ever after, you wanting something long-term and committed. I see you wanting your peace here. And I'm seeing a younger energy around you, okay? Either a Cancer, a Pisces, Scorpio, or a Aquarius, a Libra, or a Gemini. Somebody here keeping an eye on you, okay? Now, I'm seeing you working really hard, some of y'all, with the Eight of Coins. You're working hard here, okay? Some of you have a new job. Or you're just focusing on work right now and really just having your peace now in the center of your reading there's a king of wands here an aries a leo or a sagittarius okay this looks like somebody very fiery very passionate that's very attractive to you okay and they're coming up under the tower card okay so let's clarify and let's see what the hell is going on Let's see what the hell is going on. All right, spirit, show me the Ten of Cups, please. What's going on with this Ten of Cups for my Libras? Spirit, what's going on with this Ten of Cups for my Libras? Yeah, oh, okay. So, yep. Some of y'all just got out of a court case. Some of y'all went through a divorce with this person. It went in your favor. Some of y'all, okay, because the Ten of Cups is clarified here, but the Five of Cups in reverse, the Justice card, Libra energy, uh, that's your major arcana card, the Ten of Cups in reverse, and the Chariot card. So I see some of you guys have just ended something. I see you getting over the pain from it, the ending here. Um, something here, some type of loss that you suffered. I see you getting out of it. I see you possibly left it because you know what you deserve. Um, and you're not settling and you want to be treated fairly and that's that and this was something that you possibly believe long term in but I see you even though it did not work out cancer energy I see you the chariot still having willpower determination to move forward in love to move forward in what it is that you want in love and not give up on your happily ever after okay possibly this is with somebody a knight of pentacles in reverse Okay, somebody that just wasn't putting in the work towards this the way they should have, wasn't focused on you in this connection, how they should have, could have been um, unreliable, untrustworthy. Show me this tower card, please. Why is this tower here for my Libras? Why, why is this tower here for my Libras? Okay, the tower is clarified by the Eight of Wands and Reverse the Empress. The Six of Pentacles in Reverse and the Death card. Yeah, y'all definitely ended something here. 
The Wheel of Fortune is here again in reverse. So right now, is is this shit was hard for y'all. Y'all feeling like this shit was. Is is you going through a tough time right now with that Wheel of Fortune in reverse twice? You know what I mean? Um, I don't see you taking action with that Eight of Wands in reverse. I see shit. Is, some of y'all, this shit was a little bit out of control, um, especially with that Tower. But I see the Empress here. Somebody here might be pregnant. Could have had something to do with that. Um, that's an older woman energy, motherly type energy. And then I'm seeing the Six of Pentacles in reverse, which shows me that maybe the breakup had something to do with someone um, either taking from you or they're not being an equal give and take. You giving more to this than the other person. Okay. Then I'm seeing the death card again. So again, the death card is about an ending. So you definitely ended something here. Scorpio energy, double Scorpio energy. Definitely was an ending here. But, you know, the ending is about a new beginning. Okay. That's what that death card is about. Show me this page of cups in reverse, please, spirit. Show me the page of cups in reverse. Why is this page of cups in reverse? The four of swords, the king of cups in reverse, the four of pentacles, and the moon. Huh. With the ten of pentacles. See, this was something y'all ended something here. Some of y'all were living with this person. You could have had kids with this person. Okay. This person, I feel like I'm. this is your person's energy coming through here. Some of y'all, this is a, a Cancer, a Pisces, or a Scorpio, a water sign, or somebody very emotionally unstable, somebody who's got possibly childhood issues, somebody who has, uh, that's very immature, that's very, like I said, has um, very, very sensitive, okay? Um, but I see them here, either this person is going through a rest, they're, they're trying to heal right now after this breakup with you. I see them being withdrawn with the King of Cups in reverse. Um, but I do see them um, clinging on to you with the Four of Pentacles. I don't feel like they've let you go completely. And with the Moon card, I feel like it might be something that they're not telling you. It's a secret, okay? Um, something here that's um, not being revealed to you, okay? Show me the Page of Cups. Show me the Page of Swords in reverse. Show me the Page of Swords in reverse. The Emperor, the Knight of Pentacles. Oof, the Ace of Cups. Oof, and the Judgment. Okay. So with the Ace of Wands in reverse, okay, hmm, this is you guys, okay, so this is you guys, I don't know if y'all spying on this person or not, um, possibly this might be you, if not, I think this might be you, I don't know, this might be this person spying on you, if you're dealing with an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, I feel like this person is spying on you, this person is coming in as the Emperor, you could be dealing with the Aries, but I feel like this person wants to, um, they do want to take order here. They do want to come in and take order. I just don't feel like they feel like right now is the time. Like I see some of y'all not even talking to this person since you broke up. Okay. I feel like this person feels like they, you know, they were loyal. They were committed to you in this relationship. And um, some of you, but I see that I see the ace of cups is in reverse. So there was some type of unrequited love here situation or This person is still in pain over the heart, the breakup between the two of you. The judgment is in reverse, so they may still be blaming you or blaming themselves about things here that happened in the relationship. Some of y'all have kids with this person. Show me the Hierophant in reverse. Five of Wands in reverse, the Eight of Wands in reverse, the Empress, and the Six of Pentacles. Again, in reverse with the Fool in reverse. Hmm. Again. Some of y'all left this situation because y'all needed y'all peace. With that Five of Wands in reverse, it was a lot of drama, conflict with this person. Um, a lot of drama, especially with that Eight of Wands. Again, in reverse, shit was just going haywire. Um, I'm seeing some of y'all mother energy here again, this Empress card. So either somebody was pregnant here, or this is like an older mother energy, or this is you just coming into your power. You know what I mean? Um, staying in your power in this. I feel that the Six of Pentacles is here again in reverse. So again, I'm feeling like y'all, this person took a lot from y'all. This person, this person took a lot from y'all. I feel like y'all were real giving in this, nurturing in this, like y'all really cared in this relationship. Y'all really gave it y'all all. But I don't see y'all jumping into anything new right now with this fool in reverse. Show me the king of wands. The 
King of Cups, the Hermit, ooh, the Eight of Swords, ooh, and the Six of Wands. So this person is in love with you. King of Wands again here. Wow, twice from two different tarot decks. Some of you are dealing with an Aries, a Leo, a Sagittarius. Um, this person wants to take direct action towards you. This person loves you, uh, whoever this King of Wands is, but I feel like they're right now going through a, um, they're in Hermit mode. Could be a Virgo. Okay, right now they have a lot of things on their mind with that Eight of Swords. They feel trapped by something here, possibly the fact that it didn't work out between the two of you. But I see them love you. I see that they love you. They have a lot of love for you. They're just trying to go through a spiritual enlightenment right now. Um, just trying to really connect with spirit. They're possibly in solitude mode right now. Okay. But I see that they, this person loves you, like the King of Cups. Could be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Okay. That's the second time we're seeing that. Show me the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. The Empress again, the Six of Pentacles in reverse again, and the Queen of Pentacles. See that? And the Seven. Some of y'all, this has something to do with somebody else. There's another person here. Okay? Some of y'all, that's why. Like, you got clarity here about some something here. You got clarity, possibly, that there was somebody else here. With the seven of cups in reverse, you found out, like you got clarity, you got, you understood here, you know, this was revealed to you, six of pentacles in reverse. Again, this is about you guys, somebody taking here, it not being an equal give and take here, Libra, okay? And look at you as the empress and the queen of pentacles, you've been giving and giving and giving. And what did you get in return? Nothing. That's why you're feeling like the wheel of fortune is in reverse. Okay, some of y'all may not be two people. This is just showing how giving you've been, how nurturing you've been in this connection towards this person. And then it's showing six of pentacles in reverse. You didn't get that back in return. It was not reciprocated towards you. Show me the five of swords in reverse, please, spirit. Eight of Wands, again in reverse. The Empress, again in reverse. The Six of Pentacles, again in reverse. With the Tower and the Four of Wands. Yo, how many times is this going to come out for you? The Empress is here again with the Six of Pentacles, again in reverse. Libra, you're the Empress. Did I drop a card? Oh, yeah. My titty knocked something over. You're the empress here, Libra. You you are abundant in this. Look at you. You need your peace. I see that you held your shit together. You've been the empress. I haven't seen you reverse well yet. So you held your shit together throughout this. Even though shit wasn't going the way you wanted it to go. Even though this person just kept taking from you. Energetically, could have been materially, material-wise. And the tower is here. This is what broke y'all up. The tower is here twice. Four of wands in reverse. You see what I'm saying? Wow. Heavy energy, Libra. <laughs> Excuse me. Show me the ten of coins, please. Show me the ten of coins. The Four of Pentacles, the Knight of Wands, the Three of Cups, and the Hermit. With the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. You see, this is a new beginning for you that's here. I see y'all very passionate about towards what y'all want. I see a fire sign coming in here for y'all. I see a fire sign coming in for y'all. Somebody here that I think is clinging on to y'all that possibly want to take y'all out to eat. Some of y'all got an invitation from somebody here. Somebody that's passionate about y'all. Uh, possibly somebody like to travel a lot. Somebody that be on the move a lot. Okay. But I see a lot of passion. I see the person's very attracted to you or you're very attracted to them. And I see 
Some of y'all still think about something from the past here. But I see this person want to take y'all out. With that three of cups. Person want to go out with you. But I see y'all being hermit. <laughs> and the ace of pentacles is in reverse. Y'all still think about this person. So some of y'all got somebody new here. Trying to come in. Show me the eight of coins. The Justice card, the Ace of Wands in reverse, the Chariot, and the Seven of Pentacles. With the oh, with the Ace of Cups on the bottom of the deck. Libra. This is you working towards your future. <laughs> because you know what you deserve. Look at you, the chariot. Some of y'all really making y'all money right now. You're looking good. You've invested in something. Okay. But whatever y'all went through, I see y'all, you got the chariot here again. Some of y'all could be dealing with a cancer. You're very strong and you're very determined to get through this. And I love that about you, Libra. You're determined that you're going to get through this. Even, even you keep coming up, you kept coming up as the empress. Upright. How many times have we pulled that? That shows me you're confident in yourself. That shows me that you're, look at you. The empress is that bitch or that man. You know what I mean? Like you're on top. You're abundant. You're prosperous. You are the life bringer. You know what I mean? Look at you. The justice card is here. Your major arcana card again. This is you wanting fairness, knowing what you deserve, Libra. Knowing what you deserve. And you're not going to give up eight of, eight of coins. You're not going to give up. The chariot, you're not going to give up. The seven of pentacles, you're not going to give up. I think that some of you are a little bit hesitant with this ace of wands in reverse to start something new here, which I don't blame you because it's a lot. But look, the universe is saying ace of cups is here for you. New love is here. We're going to go into the extended now and I'm going to get into the way your person is feeling Pull their cards, see what they're feeling towards you. Um, I'm picking up two energies here. So somebody here that you ended things with, and then I'm seeing possibly somebody else here, somebody new coming in. So I'm going to focus on their on their energies, and um, we'll go from there. Um, if you would like to uh, watch the extended, you can click on the link down in the description box below. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching, Libras, and I'll see you in the extended. Mwah. Blessings. Thanks for watching and tell somebody that you love them. Bye.